The long, long race of which you cannot see the end. Weary of having to quarantine at home, wearing masks and following other health precautions caused by coronavirus. It's almost become normalized. That's, that's how it's become. 73-year-old Steve Davidoff is looking forward to when the COVID-19 vaccine is available to him. I will get it. I will get the vaccine. And uh, there's no questions about that. He's talked to his 75-year-old brother Harvey about getting it. For the past two and a half years, Harvey has lived in a Baltimore nursing home. Hey, Harv, how you doing today? I'm doing pretty good. Harvey says his life right now is like the movie Groundhog Day. For him it is. Every day is the same. Every day is the same day. I get up a certain time, get out of bed, eat, do the same thing over and over. The brothers are close. They talk five times a day or more. Harvey says the nursing home tests him for COVID each week. You're uh, following the uh, CDC guidelines and they're doing what they need to do to keep us and themselves safe. And the nursing home gives updates about the numbers of workers and residents who have contracted the virus. We asked Harvey if he wants the COVID vaccine. I've been watching the news every day. Um, as soon as I, I think it's great, man. I mean, it come a long way from when, it, when this thing started. Um, and I'm just, they say, from what I understand, it's 95% uh, effective. If it is offered to you, the vaccine, what are you going to do? I'm going to take it, I think. I'm going to take it. Harvey Davidoff says that at this point, the nursing home has not said any, given out any information about when that vaccine might be available. He will take it, as he said, but he is also concerned because he would like to know a little bit more about any possible side effects. Reporting live from downtown Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV 11 News.